Good afternoon, my name is Tom Brinsonoff, Certified Master Mechanic out of Reading, Pennsylvania, and today we're going to talk about engine thermostats and overheating. Now here I have two separate different thermostats. As you can see, if I flip these over, they're completely different designs. Basically do the same, same operation. It's just a matter of the application. This one's in a, a, a Pontiac Grand Prix 3.1. This one come out of a, a Chevy pickup. This particular one here and this one here, as you can see, if you can see the springs on the inside of them, what they do is when they heat up, they, they get weak and then they, this section right here opens up and allows the coolant to flow through. It does the same thing on this one. The spring heats up, opens up, and allows the coolant to flow through. A lot of the problems that you have with these when they overheat is they end up getting stuck closed and they don't allow the coolant to flow through your engine from your right ear and through your engine and back, back and forth. But Sometimes they also stick open. It's, they opened up at one point in time and it got the operating temperature and they never closed. Now in, in that case what happens is you actually get no heat out of it and it actually runs cold. But for the purpose of overheating, the coolant runs through this hose right here down into your thermostat housing. It'll come through here and as the engine temperature picks up it, it heats this, this back portion up. It'll open it up and allow it to flow through. Now as long as this is working correctly, it should open up about 190 degrees, 195 degrees. If it doesn't open up, it will overheat. And the primary, the primary cause of an engine overheating is usually the thermostat. Um, other than that, there's, there's really not much, of a, much to them. That's about all they do. They just open and close depending on the temperature of the inside of the engine. About 195 degrees is when you want this thing to open and close. And that's about all there is to it. And that's... Uh, Engine thermostats and overheating.